All right, you know what I'm praising glory to your how about shit, how shy about shit with cock dash, the bonus of L's of GMS, also salutations to all the item out there that's pushing this truth, and also shalom to the rest of the whole full elect, and uh, you know they're in transit on the way to camp, all right, and uh, go ahead, man. All right, shalom, hey, uh, <laughs> I did a video earlier speaking about how, uh, Halloween was very, very lackluster this year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there's one thing. But you know what? <laughs> uh, Lord Judge, he brought some judgment on Halloween. He was like a little man shooting. Oh, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of death, you know, that happened. I think it was in New York or whatever. Anyways, man. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, let's jump to Ephesians, the uh, fourth chapter. Okay. Because yep. we don't really have a topic. You know, but there's plenty of things we can touch on, especially with this election thing going on. Mm -hmm. All right, what they're speaking of, post-violence election yep. and, and these different things, man, or them, you know, so-called still in the election. Yeah, there's already violence at the polls, the early voting. Right, so, and that's Esau, you know, stirring the pot, you know. We're going here, man. Start the top? Yeah. Ephesians 4 and 1. I, therefore... The prisoner of the Lord beseech you that ye walk worthy of the vocation wherewith oh, ye are called. Oh, so that's beautiful right there. All right. So uh, we post some. Look up that word worthy. Yep. All right. That we walk worthy. All right. Or, or what? We post to do the things that's uh, pleasing to the Lord. You know what that scripture is? Where it say uh, things that's pleasing. Baruch 4. Yep. Pleasing to the Lord. But basically, we post to please you. How about Shah Shai? You know. In his flesh to the best of our ability. All right. Yep. And then we're supposed to walk, walk, walk worthily in this truth, man. Go ahead. Yep. Worthy is uh, axios in the Greek. It's suitably, worthily, in a manner worthy of. It says, as becometh after a godly source. Oh, you see, after a godly source. So, what's that? Uh, Gram uh, grab me that in Peter. What manner of person ought ye to be? In conduct, in God, yeah, in, 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 in conversation. And when you go and go into that word conversation, too, yes, sir, yeah. Right? Because that conversation means conduct, all right? Mm -hmm. So you're supposed to have a certain kind of uh, conduct, all right? You're supposed to carry yourself in a certain manner, okay? Uh, the scriptures speaks about, uh, you'll grab that too, about letting your light shine forth amongst man, mm -hmm. all right? But not just any, uh, not just man in general, but also the, the, the brothers too, all right? They're supposed to see your conduct. They're supposed to see how you act too, okay? Yep. The yep. scripture speaks about having a good name, all right? Yep. A good reputation, okay? Yep. Look on here. Uh, 2 Peter 3 and 11. Seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved, mm -hmm. what manner of persons Ought ye to be uh -huh. in all holy conversation? Right. In all holy or what? In all holy conduct. Look up that word, conversation. Okay. Conversation. Anastrophe. Uh, manner of life. Uh -huh. You see, manner of life. You see? How are you living your, your life? Are you trying to live a godly life? All right. With the scriptures, it says what? We're going to rehearse the rehearse the righteous acts all right so don't get me wrong you know we we ain't gonna get it uh perfect man you know the scripture says the righteous man follows seven times and get back up again you yep. see so we you ain't gonna we, we, ain't, we ain't gonna get perfect we ain't gonna be perfect until your Howard shot come back all right it's just that simple man yep. all right in other words uh if we was perfect guess what we wouldn't need your Howard shot all right that's why that's why your Howard made sure what that sacrifice was was perfect it had to be perfect all yeah. right so it can bring us into perfection we're going here it says conduct behavior deportment hey, hey, cause look, look, you, <laughs> like the scripture says you can't bring a clean thing out of what out of an unclean thing you see so that sacrifice had to be on point all right that godly sacrifice had to be on point man you know the lord found something that was pure that was holy all right that was that was that was unblemished. Mm -hmm. Okay, but go ahead. Yeah, deportment. And I looked the word deportment up. It says a person's behavior or manners. 
And it's like, you know, especially new brothers coming in, that's why it's like very vital to read the scriptures, especially like, you know, like Proverbs and like Sirach, because it teaches you the manners, it teaches you the, how to conduct yourself, how to, you know what I mean, be around brothers and people in the world, you know? But uh, that was it on the second Peters. Go ahead. Do you want uh, the Baruch or you yeah, want- Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Okay. Which I don't- Think that's that's it? I don't say? think that's it. Read it, read it anyway. Okay. Read it out loud. Just gonna go back to Ephesians. Okay. Go ahead. Baruch four and Israel. Uh, <laughs> Baruch four and four uh -huh. says, "Oh Israel, happy are we for things that are pleasing to the Most High are made known unto us." All right. Which I think that's that's something else. Though. Okay. All right. But still, but still though, the things that's pleasing to the Lord is made uh, is made known unto us, but not just any us. Talking about the elect, especially on this side, man. All right, but the things that please Yahweh, by Shai, all right, uh, is known is 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 uh, revealed to his elect, man. All right. Yep. The 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 others, all right. They're 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 blinded, all right. They're dumb, deaf, and blind. They can't they they can't see uh, uh, or understand what what uh, what godliness is, all right. And the, guess what? They don't they don't want to know. They don't give a damn. You know, yeah, they they they, they, they want to stay in that in that reprobate state. You know, Fine. go ahead. Oh, I got the, the other one you quoted, uh, mm -hmm. Matthew five and sixteen. Fine, I did want that. Go ahead. It says, "Let your light so shine before men." All right, see, let your light shine among men. What is the, what is the light? Light is something about your wisdom. All right, or oh, what? Uh, we always talk about. You know, most people see that we have some kind of glow. You know. Mm -hmm. That's why, you know, people kind of draw to us a little bit, you know. Staring at you. Staring at you or always want to talk to you or touch you. Tell you <laughs> tell you their problems. Yeah, tell you their problems, you, you know. You everybody therapists and shit. <laughs> but go ahead. It says, neither, oh, pardon, verse And 16. that's because we bear a, a certain kind of, we, we bear the Holy Spirit. Yeah. Right? The scripture speaks about, uh, uh. Give me that in the book of Wisdom of Solomon. The scripture speaks about the, the Holy Spirit not being defiled. Right. First chapter. Right? Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Wisdom of Solomon 1 and 4. I think. For into a malicious soul, wisdom shall not enter, nor dwell in the body that is subject unto sin. Mm -hmm. For the Holy Spirit of discipline will flee deceit. Mm -hmm. And remove from thoughts that are right, 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 right. So the Holy Spirit, all right, it, hey, the Holy Spirit of this is gonna flee the sea, all right, or what, or all wicked manner of, of things, man. You know, mm -hmm. go ahead. It says, and remove from thoughts that are without understanding, uh -huh. and will not. I right, see, it's gonna remove thoughts without that. That's without understanding. You see, mm -hmm. people see that light, you know, and and, and they and and and, and they want to know. What well, we know, all right, or or or, or, or they want to know what's what's on your mind. Yeah. You know, go ahead. It says, and will not abide when unrighteousness cometh in. Ooh, you see, and will not abide when unrighteousness come in. You see. Yep. But y'all, it was another scripture though, uh, which speaks about uh, the the. Well, I and mean, I could be mixing them up. Yeah, you know? high, high sound. Don't don't worry about it. We just gonna keep it rolling. But that did it did go into the conduct though. Yeah. Yep. You know, it says, seeing, go back to the Peter, seeing all these things shall be dissolved, meaning what? Look, the world, the world about to, about the America's going to be destroyed, right? And the world is changing right before our eyes. So knowing the prophecies, knowing the information that we know, then how are we supposed to conduct ourselves? What type of manners are we supposed to have? What's the, what are the do's and don'ts in this, in this walk? Yeah. You know, having the Holy Spirit of discipline, you know? All right, but uh, let's go back, back to, to the that Ephesians. Ephesians. Yeah. Ephesians four and one. I therefore, the prisoner of the Lord, beseech you that ye walk worthy of the vocation wherewith you are called. And I think that word. Can I look up the word go vocation? Ahead, go ahead. I think that word means like a job or something. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Vocation means. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Vocation in the Greek, it's uh, klesis, 
A calling. Yeah, so calling. A calling. So like a uh, calling, an invitation to a feast mm -hmm. of the divine invitation. Right, 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 right. So when you uh, uh when you go into what's that? Uh, the book of Luke, when the Lord invited the man to his feast. All right. Well, if you if you invite somebody to a feast, right? Yeah. Uh, uh, that that person yeah, is supposed to have a certain conduct at that feast too. Mm -hmm. You know, that, that you 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 don't go uh, uh grabbing food with your fucking hands, you know, <laughs> or uh, uh talking with food in your mouth. Yeah, you know, shit like that. You know, elbows on the table. Yeah, elbows on the table. Yeah. Go ahead. I looked up that word vocation in the regular dictionary too. It says a strong feeling of suitability. Suitability. For a particular career or occupation, mm -hmm. so it's like, are you are you suitable? Yeah, like the, the scripture says uh, in Second Ezra, the eighth chapter, it says, "Seek out the glory for those that be like thee." No, don't worry about everybody else, because Ezra mm -hmm. Ezra was basically fitting the mold. He was fitting the mold of Yahweh Shai, because the angel told him, he said, "Thou hast humbled thyself as it becometh thee." Though that's what you were su just supposed to do anyway. So now, because you did that, you are marvelous in the sight of the Most High. And don't worry about nobody else except those that's, that be like you, those that's trying to be suitable. It says uh, a person's employment or main occupation, especially regarded as particularly worthy and requiring great dedication. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Uh, Ephesians 4 and 2. With all lowliness and meekness, with long suffering, forbearing one another in love. Mm -hmm. Endeavoring to keep the unity of the spirit in the bond of peace, and when you endeavor to do something, that means you 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 striving, all right, to to keep it a certain way, all right. You striving to 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 be unified, all right. One Lord, one faith, one baptism, one God and Father of all, who is above all and through all and in you all. Let me keep going. Go ahead. It says, but unto every one of us is given grace according to the measure of the gift of Hamashiach. Wherefore he said, when he ascended up on high, he led captivity captive and gave gifts unto men. Yep. We're going to stop right there. Okay. Hey, so with that, man, we're going to give all glory to, to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Kakadash. Double honor to the LGMS, also citation, so I can out there that's pushing this truth. And also, shalom to the rest of the whole four-leg peace. Shalom.